look over my shoulder and watch as I create a 30 second nature observation for nature's wild things. See my workflow process for transforming raw video footage into something ready for publishing. This raw video is from a photo walk on February 27, 2017 and it was in one of the parks located in Cabarrus County, North Carolina and that is in the United States. Alright, you've seen some of the raw video footage. Now let's take a look at uh, editing our pretty little bird here today. It is an eastern tohi male. And uh, I know their calls or their songs, but uh, this is not the song. This is more a call. <laughs> If you go online and listen to their songs, it's not this. So this, I think, is going to have to be classified as a call. And let's take a look at what we're working with here today. Uh, we're in Final Cut Pro. And uh, we're going to be working with audio and video today so we can get his call. And uh, I've turned on with Final Cut Pro. You can uh, go down here and turn on audio scrubbing. And with audio scrubbing, you actually hear the, the noises. I'm going through at a faster speed as I'm scrubbing through, so I actually hear the noises. It helps when you're editing with, with audio here. And uh, I think today what I'm going to do is grab this and move it down to the timeline. We have a clip that's just a little over a minute and 30 seconds long. And uh, we'll go down here and look at the beginning. Let's just listen for a second. Airplane noises in the background. The camera's moving around a little bit. And uh, we're going to look through here to see if there's a section of this video that we can turn into one of our 30 second videos. And I think we have enough to work with. We're not going to be slowing it down today to see the action because uh, we want to hear the call. And when you <laughs> slow down video, it garbles up the audio. So we're going to uh, have to uh, look at what we've got. Have some leaf rustling noises there. I think that was the cameraman moving away from the camera so that uh, he wouldn't add his breathing or uh, scuffing noises on the camera. <laughs> and when you're trying to shoot a bird in a tree from 30 feet away, um, you want to try to get it as quiet as you can. And the one way to do that sometimes is move away from the camera. And uh, the uh, end half of this video seems to be more quiet. Uh, the plane has just about gone totally away. And uh, so let's, let's take and uh, eliminate some of the airplane noises and see if we can take it past this leaf rustling and see what we've got for uh, video here now. So... We have, um, let's see, when when he the wind starts blowing here and he kind of ducks out of frame. Let's see, right about there he's looking away and then it ducks. So right about there would be a good place to, to end it here. Let's see if we can find that right there. Mark that there and... We'll grab the end of our video and we'll chop it down to size. And I'll use uh, Shift Z to expand out the timeline again so we can work with it a little better. And uh, we, we have that dropout at the end. And uh, we're working with. Um, 25 seconds. So let's see. You can add a little bit more onto the beginning of it there. Is that what's that do for us? 
you can see from the uh, little pop-up above where I'm moving the uh, video um, you can see the time and uh, the time in the clip and we can adjust that to just about 30 seconds in fact uh, maybe just a little longer Let's see what we have here try just not real happy with that let's just try seeing if we can add a little to the end Uh, that I think is closer to it. Let's uh, shift Z, move it into the timeline again. Let's see and listen to what we've got. Comes right in on a one of his calls. I like that in the video rather than waiting for it. And uh, now we still have some of the noises of the camera in the background uh, the airplane's still out there somewhere there's a highway somewhere off in the distance so we're going to uh, select our clip down here today we're going to go to audio and uh, with the audio on Final Cut Pro there's a bunch of stuff we can do here and I think one of the things I'm going to try to do is switch on the noise removal and with noise removal I know from using this in the past I can crank it up a little bit let's go to about 80 percent there let's see if that's really that's really quieted it down a lot now we still hear his bird call hear the bird in the background the robin in the background Yeah, I'm liking the way that sounds right now. Now, he spends most of his time at the beginning of the 30 seconds here off to the left a little bit. And I think what I want to do is center him up when he starts out. Uh, he goes to the right here a little bit, so let's see what we can do with a with a very simple crop um, we could do a, a Ken Burns effect but the purpose of this 30 second video is to really show off his call and to uh, concentrate and look at the bird as he's doing it so I think what we're gonna do is just uh, do a plain old crop. So I want to go to the video side of things and I want to turn on the crop tool right here. Let's move the timeline back over so we can uh, see where he starts from. Now what I'm going to do, this is just like editing a photo, or cropping a photo. We select the crop tool and we can, I think I Went a little too far, so I'm going to take that. Now, knowing that he's going to move a little, let's let's just uh, maybe just a little bit more size here. Now that'll chop off some of the. Uh, I didn't succeed in getting him centered though, did I? Well, let's try that again then. Let's turn back on the crop tool. Move him over a little. Alright, so just like in photography we can crop our video. He's just I think off to the left a little bit, but he's going to move to the right a little bit, so 
I think it'll kind of make up for it. So we've quieted our uh, audio down. We've uh, centered them up so you can see them a little bit better. I believe, what else do we have to do? I believe we should put our dissolve on the end. Kind of finalize um, what we're doing here. Let's just see how that looks. I believe we have another 30 seconds of nature screencast in the can.